What is up guys, Daniel Manuel here, otherwise known as Lawnbeer 180, otherwise known as DH Media. Uh, with an exciting announcement today, I have finally upgraded to a new camera. This was a long time in the making. I've been using the Canon 80D forever, and it's been great, don't get me wrong, I love it. Uh, and it's still gonna be used as a second camera, um, but it was definitely time to do an upgrade. So today I went and pulled the trigger on a Canon EOS R6 mirrorless camera. I've had my eye on the R6 for quite a long time. I think what happened was, you know, obviously during COVID, we didn't get to do many weddings. And finally, back in May, I did my first one of the summer and I was like super stoked, I had a lot of fun. I was like, man, I wish I had um, a better camera. I wish I could upgrade. So that's when I started doing research and I learned about the EOS R6, um, watched quite a, quite a bit of different reviews, looking at its features. And honestly, it's just exactly what I'm looking for in a camera. Uh, it has built-in stabilization, which is huge. So, you know, obviously when I'm filming weddings, I'm constantly walking around, whether it's following the bride and groom, whether it's getting a different angle during the ceremony, uh, walking around during the reception and, um, you know, filming the guests. In any case, having that built-in stabilization and being able to walk around and keep a you know a consistent steady uh, clip without having to edit it in post it's going to be super nice so that was one feature that really stood out to me besides that i mean it's the same ergonomic canon design that we all like uh, for any dslr camera um, you know right now it's on my tripod i got my mic hooked up to it um, but same feel lightweight easy to use very mobile um, I do not like to be grounded while I'm filming weddings. I like to be very free. Typically, I don't use anything except for the strap around the camera to help keep things still. Um, so like I said, with that, with that built-in civilization, I can continue to be free moving so I don't miss any moments while I'm filming weddings. Outside of that, um, obviously I'm shooting in 4K right now. Um, it's pretty bright, it's pretty bright. We're still late in the afternoon, so there's a lot of kind of glares right now. Um, but my plan is to go out this evening when the uh, lighting is a little bit better and get some, you know, just different random clips to show you all and to test out for myself. If anybody has any questions about the EOS R6, I'd be happy to look into it. Uh, vice versa, if you have one and have any advice for me, I'd um, definitely be open to hearing any suggestions, especially when it comes to video. Um, but with that, I appreciate you watching. Happy wedding season, happy 2021, and have a good day, folks. Bye-bye. So initial thoughts, I'm pretty excited. Uh, this camera does a really good job of just shooting on the fly. I can focus in and out of subjects really easily. Um, I can obviously, this lens has a really nice zoom capabilities. Um, the stabilization is phenomenal. We're just about down to sunset. I have a couple more things I wanna show you. Um, but first, let's get a few quick few shots of my car. It's looking pretty clean right now.